Andreas Giorgio at the 2018 IMF European Open Championships. Now joined by Inge Berg-Helga from Team Iceland. Unanimous decision victory today to advance to the semi-finals tomorrow here in Romania. You defeated Inka Raki from Finland and it was a fantastic performance. You just really inserted your dominance from the beginning. You just controlled the pace, controlled the cage in fact. Are you happy with how you fought today? Uh, yeah, I'm pretty happy. I would have finished the fight a little bit earlier. Uh, and that's my plan for the next fight. Uh, but otherwise, yeah, it was a good warm-up. <laughs> <laughs> this is your first experience of IMAF competition here, international IMAF. How do you feel the tournament structure benefits you or do you think that potentially there, there's problems, it, it makes it more difficult knowing that you have to fight multiple times in multiple days? Um, I really like it. I lo love doing this, so yeah, it's great. Uh, I'm looking forward for tomorrow and I didn't take any damage, so it's no problem for me. I felt like in the whole fight, you always had a smile on your face during the <laughs> whole fight. Is, you're just enjoying the moment, is it, would that be correct? Yeah, definitely. It's just, it was, I had so much fun. I've never had this much fun in my life. Uh, and I'm here to enjoy this and dominate these girls. I'm going to get the gold. So. Is there any added pressure being the only Icelandic fighter here in Bucharest? No, I don't think so. It's just the two of us, me and my brother, my coach, and it's fantastic, it's great. Don't have to worry about any group <laughs> and where somebody else wants to go, so it's great. Do you feel like MMA in Iceland is, is growing bigger and bigger now? Do you think that it's, it's finally making a breakthrough in the way that we look at how the support is growing for the Icelandic football team? That's absolutely massive. Yeah. Do you feel like MMA's popularity could potentially one day challenge that? Um, yeah, it could be, could be. Uh, I'm not not quite sure about it, how it will go in the future, but we have a lot of young um, MMA fighters that are really good and getting better and better every day. So, yeah. What would a gold medal mean to you to at the end of this, this fantastic week to, to be stood probably in this very spot, this is where they're going to put the podium and have a gold medal put around your neck? What would that mean? It will be... Just perfect. That's what I came for. I'm going for the gold. I won't leave without it. <laughs> Definitely not. Thank you very much for your time. Thank, Thank you. you.